birthday was uh, last Tuesday. I know you forgot to get me a gift. That's okay. Um, nobody got me a gift, but if you really want to make it up to me, all you have to do is leave a like on this video. My first video back in a while, so let's see if we can get to 61.3 likes. I personally don't really find birthday significant, and I don't like telling people that it's my birthday because I don't understand why I should be congratulated on doing what I'm supposed to do which is live. I was put on this earth to live. Why am I being congratulated for living another year, especially another year of my life, which is so meaningless, dry, boring, I, I can't think of other adjectives to describe how terrible my life is. As you can tell, I care so little about my birthday. I think it's gotten to the point where people care more about my own birthday than I care about my own birthday. I mean, for starters, on the morning of my birthday, I, I had forgotten that um, it, it was my birthday. I'm not even kidding. My mom came into my room at 6.30 a.m. I was like, what are you doing in my room so early? And she was yelling at me to wake up and blow out the candles on my cake. And as you can tell from this photo, um, I, I wasn't having it. Thanks to my mom for posting that photo on Facebook. Even after I told her not to post it, she, she did it anyway. Also, having the song Happy Birthday sung to you at 6.30 a.m. isn't really a pleasant experience. Having the birthday song sung to you at all at any time of the day is not a pleasant experience. I'm just sitting there awkwardly. I want the song to be over. I want to eat some cake. And I don't really know if I'm supposed to sing along or if I'm supposed to smile. It just puts me in a really uncomfortable situation. And also, if you look closer, Closely at that photo, I have a twin sister. You don't really need to look that closely because she's literally right there. Most people say that she's me in girl form, which is really weird to think about, but it's also kind of true. But yeah, I share a birthday with my sister, which takes all the attention from me, and it goes towards her. And I'm really having trouble figuring out why that is, because Sabrina does social activities, has friends, and I sit in my basement and make subpar YouTube videos. But yeah, on the day of my birthday, my sister got a balloon and a bunch of gifts from her friends, and all I got was 18 birthday punches and three birthday shout outs on Twitter. Having school on your birthday, the worst thing ever. I'm sure most people can agree with that. I wanted to keep it low key, maybe have a few friends like dat me up and be like, hey bro, happy birthday, but that did not happen. It was actually going fine until one of my teachers decided it was a good idea to announce to the entire class that it was my birthday. That thanks for that, you're, you're probably not watching this, but thank you. To which everyone started simultaneously screaming at me, happy birthday, which, which was great. All these people who had never talked to me in high school thought it was important to say happy birthday to me. Like, I would have been just fine with you saying absolutely nothing to me because you've chosen to ignore me through four years of high school. I kind of wanted to relax on my birthday and do nothing like I do on pretty much every day, but my parents forced me to go out to eat on my my birthday. You know, you would think this would be the day where, hey Eric, you can do whatever you want. Dude, do, do, you know, just, just chill out. And this birthday was different than most because as I mentioned, I'm 18 years old and everybody likes to hype up being 18 like it's this awesome thing. It, it really isn't that cool. Notable things you can do at the age of 18 include voting for the US presidential election and buying cigarettes. But these things really aren't that cool because with the electoral college your vote doesn't actually matter and uh, cigarettes uh, kill you and, and I kind of want to live so it is this like wave of responsibility which kind of sucks because now I'm an adult and I have to do everything on my own. I didn't really get anything for my birthday so I decided I would have my own little celebration so with my new visa card I decided to go out and purchase concert tickets. I had no one to go with me because I don't really have that many friends and the friends I do have lack any sense of music taste. So I went to this concert. I was 18. I was responsible for myself. I was just chilling out, living the life. I'm pretty sure I was the youngest person at that concert. Most people were over the age of 21 because they all had those wristbands where you could buy alcohol with them. That's the thing that sucks about being 18 is that it's just a wannabe 21. When you're 21, you can do all these cool things like purchase alcohol and then there's me who's like technically responsible for himself, but, but I can't buy, I can't buy liquor. But this birthday did get me thinking. I noticed how everyone takes this stuff seriously and cherish these moments and I just don't care. I was kind of indifferent. My sister organized a birthday party and made it out to be this big thing where we went to Dave and Buster's and after we went to Dave and Buster's, she was like, all right guys, let's go out to eat. And I was like, I, I don't really care. And, and I went home. But if anything, I see birthdays as depressing because it's like we're one year closer to death. The older we are, the 
more likely we are to die. Each time I have a birthday, I feel like my youth is slowly slipping away from me and all the things I want to do are becoming less attainable. I'm basically having a midlife crisis at 18 and I'm sorry this video just took a dark turn. I'm, I know that was kind of depressing. Let me know what you think of birthdays in the comments down below. I'd love to know what you think. And also, if you're 18 years old or above the age of 18, I assume most of you are children, but if you're over the age of 18, tell me what it's like being an adult. I'd, I'd love to hear if there are any perks of it because it sounds like to me there really aren't that many perks. I'll make sure to be responding to all the comments. Here are today's comments of the day. I've decided I'm going to do comments of the day, so I'm going to be featuring um, a ton of comments. So make sure to leave a comment. Uh, I really appreciate you watching today's video. Make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed. I'm going to try to be making weekly videos, so I will see you next week. I am vindicated. I am selfish. So